Buildings across Melbourne could be a lot cooler if only they painted their roofs white, according to new University of Melbourne research. The collaborative project involving researchers from architecture, engineering, and land and environment has been looking at how paint, materials, and even plants can help cool a building from the top down, reducing energy bills in the process. Dr. Dominique Hess, a senior lecturer in sustainable architecture, says that white paint on the roof is a simple yet effective way to help keep occupants cool. It's got two effects. One is that it keeps the inside cooler, so you have to do less cooling, spend less money on cooling your house or your building. Um, the second is that um, because you're not holding that heat, you're not adding to the urban heat iron effect, where the city tends to be four to five degrees warmer than the country, and on a really hot day, that makes a big difference. So you've got two benefits there. The roof of the Art Play building here at Barung Ma was one of the first to be painted white. And as Dr. Dominic Hess says, its occupants are already feeling the benefits. So I talked to one of the teachers here at the Art Play and she just said the, the parents and the kids are so much happier. They can run their programs much longer because they don't need to send kids home because it's too hot in the building. So there's a real benefit there to the people in the building. Cool roofs work by reflecting the sun's heat away from the building and back into the atmosphere. This can help residential buildings be up to four degrees cooler in the summer and can save 3% on the energy bill in commercial buildings. Dr Nick Williams, a senior lecturer in urban horticulture, says cool roofs are vitally important as we battle the effects of climate change. As we work to adapt our cities to climate change, one of the things we really need to do is look at how we can have much cooler buildings. The sun radiates heat down on our cities and that's absorbed by uh, impervious dark surfaces. And uh, if we can work to make the city cooler, uh, we'll have a lot of climate change adaptation benefits. There's a number of different ways you can work at uh, cooling the city using changes to our roofing um, patterns. And obviously cool roofs is one of them where we reflect the uh, the solar radiation back into the atmosphere and um, we've also been working on green roofs where the uh, the solar radiation evaporates water from the plants and the substrates and cools the roofs that way and that can again cool the uh, the building underneath and also the surrounding landscape. Councillor Cathy Oak is the chair of the Future Melbourne Eco City Committee which oversaw the installation of the white roof at Art Play. She says the decision to adopt white roofs was an easy one for the council. The city is, is committed to sustainability and, and we have a zero net emission goal and so through the strategies that we've been looking at about how can we reach zero, um, we need to look at how we can reduce um, energy use in the city and white roofs is one concept that we've been looking at. It's a no-brainer, I mean, you know, why do we have roofs painted black? I just don't understand and it seems an obvious to have a reflective paint on a roof to reduce the energy. 